What's up gamers, GF Ditto here, and welcome back to this first booster box of Skylanders Battlecast opening. In this video, we will be, well, finishing out the box. This will be the finale video for my first ever recorded opening of a Skylanders Battlecast booster box. Um, it is not my first booster box, as you can see by this one back here, which I have opened just over half of. Um, and... In today's video, we're going to be opening the final 12 packs, the Pop Fizz packs, um, in an attempt to see which pack art yields the better pulls. So far, we have Eruptor in the lead with two, two Golden Holographics and three Silver Holographics, followed by Jetvac with one Golden Holographic and three Silver Holographics. So currently, Eruptor is in the lead by one Gold Holographic, I am hoping to pull the Gold Holographic Ninjini. Um, a regular Ninjini and a Silver Holographic Ninjini would be great as well, as I don't have any of them. But uh, as Ninjini is one of my favorite Skylanders, I'd like to pull all three of her. Um, Roller Brawl as well, if I'm being honest. Although Roller Brawl is a far more common card, being, I believe, a rare, whereas Ninjini is an ultimate. So let's go ahead and dive into our first pack here and see what Pop Fizz can do for us. Alright, so we're going to start off with a Rummage card. Very cool, very cool. Whiplash Bash. Fizz Bang is our epic. Power Surge for a rare... The rare smoke screen card, healing rain, a storm blade card, very nice, very nice, very cool Skylander, lightning strike, and that's it for the first pack. On to the next one. Okay, here we go. There we are. We have the Mood Ring card. Very cool. Hookshot, which features a Greeble, which is kind of interesting. I haven't seen one of those yet. A Silver Holographic Common Mad Energy. That's a Silver Hollow card. Let's leave that up in a moment. Do you feel lucky? Oh, wow. That looks really, really cool. Really cool. That's an epic. Merchant of Menace. A Beam Splitter, Shock, and Excavate. Very, very cool. And our second pack yields our first Silver Hollow, which we will sleeve up right there. Put it up there. All right, into the next pack. Hopefully, hopefully Pop Fizz can outshine Eruptor. Um, I'm, I would like to see... Uh, three gold hollows from this, including the Ninjini. All right, we have Sky Lithium Scale, which features Flash Wing. Raise Your Hands, which is a Crypt King card. Looks really, really cool. Crypt King himself! The absolute legend. That is an ultimate rare card. We have Pump It Up, which is a troll working out. That's Pump It Up. Heat Stroke, a Silver Holographic Shock card, look at that, a Shiny Helmet, and Stealth Elf, very, very cool, very cool, so that's two Silver Holographics for Pop Fizz thus far. All right, can we get a gold though? The, that's what that's what I really want to know is can we get a gold? All right, we have Trickster's Trap. That is a very nice drawing of Stealth Elf. I like that art. We have Blades of Gory, which ooh that that is cool roller brawl right there. We got Hot Pants, which is an epic. 
we have All You Can Eat, a food fight centric card. Look at that. That looks cool. Drop the Hammer. Very, very nice as well. Fuel for the Fire. Weaken. And Root. All right. So we have the Jellyfish Squall, which there's a lot going on in this card art, and I have no idea why. Even up close, uh, uh, all I can make out is a troll being attacked by Jellyfish. Still a very interesting concept. We got the Bowl of Boom! I wonder if there is a Flynn card. Like, Kelly appeared on a card, why not Flynn? Forked Lightning? Thought Theft featuring Wolfgang. Alluring Charm. An Electric Eel. An Archean Desk Fan. That is an evil desk fan if I've ever seen one. And a Healing Elixir. Very nice to have one of those on hand. Um, it's a great magic item in the games. Don't know about in the card game here. Uh, once again, I haven't yet learned how to play. Uh, I am fully intending to in the very near future, um, I hope. I've been told it's nigh impossible with just cards, but challenge accepted. All right. We've got a Sky Iron Shield. A Stone Stair. Ooh, Crusher looking menacing there. A Loka Potion. Very punny. Sap of the Ancients, which is an ultimate card. About to blow. Countdown is an amazing Skylander. Crystalline Crust. Look at that. That is magnificent. Cog of War. That somebody made a, a, a weapon out of a cog. Abraca Boom. And into the next pack we go. Um, okay. I just did that. We got the Thermal Vent, Sky Lithium Scale, Static Pulse, Force Field Generator, which is our epic, Food Fight, awesome, awesome, that is amazing, I have yet to pull him, a Beam Splitter, Amulet of Healing, Unstop a Boulder, also featuring a Greeble. I'd like to see more Chompies and less Greebles. I've only seen two Greebles, but I believe I've only seen two Chompies, too, so... Unless you count Chompy Mage, but I don't count him as a Chompy. Although, he would. Alright. We have Ninja Strike. Wishful Thinking, which is what it is when I'm hoping for, you know, my gold Ninjini card. The Epic Azurite Weather Vane. A rare Silver Hollow Vanishing Cloak. Look at that. That is nice and shiny. Let's leave that up in a minute. We got the Titan's Hilt. We got the Shower of Sparks. A Trigger Happy Skylander. Very nice. And a Hex Skylander. Once again, two Skylanders in one pack. That is uh, not the most common thing out there. Especially considering there are only 24 Skylanders in this game. And there are, I believe, 270 cards in all, not counting uh, variants for silver or gold hollows. Into the next pack. We are coming towards the end of the packs, and we still only have one. Do we even have... did we get a gold? Oh no, we have not received a singular gold hollow yet out of this. Interesting. I thought we had. Hang on. Let me just pick these up to be sure, because I thought we had, but no. They're they're Silver Hollows. Alright, Pop Fizz, you still got time to, to win this. You just gotta give us two, two Gold Hollows. Alright. So we have Blades of Gory. Again, beautiful card. Abracastabra. 
a Growth Spurt Epic card. A Vanishing Cloak, this time not holographic. Crusher himself, very nice. Spyro... Two packs in a row, two Skylanders in a row. Interesting. Surprise Attack. That's a very interesting looking card. And Earthquake. Three packs left, Pup, is three packs for you to uh, produce two gold hollows in order to potentially win this. All right, so we have Chromatic Bobble, Lightning Claw Stance, a holographic, silver holographic Lightning Claw Stance. That's cool. An epic Chill Bills Cooler. Look at that. Roller Brawl herself. Very nice. Metal Morphosis, being the other rare. Bat Attack. Unstoppable Boulder. So I'm surprised that spin isn't here. And that's it for that pack. So the Pop Fizz packs are giving us a lot in the way of Silver Hollow cards. But so far, we are down one gold. Like, we, we haven't gotten any out of it. So we have here Impending Doom. Goodie Bag. Tree Wrecked. The Ultimate Card Tree Wrecks. That's two Ultimate Skylanders in this. Awesome. The Ten Gallon Hat. Featuring Food Fight. A tidal wave. Oops. Sky lithium surge. And boo. Now it's down to it. So so far we're looking good on silver holographics. But on golds Well, I mean, Pop Fizz is kind of uh letting us down so far. Let's hopefully get some last pack magic. Let's get, get some of that last pack magic, please. All right, here we go. Last pack. Let's make it a good one, right? Sucks to be you is a chompy card. Oh my god, I love this card. Look at that, that is beautiful. Sucks to be you. And I may not know how to play the game, but if you read that description, the active enemy attacks itself. That is a... Painfully brutal card, no matter how you look at it, I'm sure. Trickster's Trap. Ghost Swords. Well, let's get a good view on these for sure. Stinker Swim, the epic card. Featuring Wolfgang and Washbuckler. A Soda Fountain. Whirl and Swirl. Shock. And Switcheroo. All right, so we did not pull any gold holographics this this time through. What we did get was four silver holographics. We got the commons, lightning claw stance, shock, and mad energy. And we got one rare as well, being the vanishing cloak. On top of those silver holographics, which are still really cool because they are holographic cards, we got the ultimate cards, uh, Sap of the Ancients, as well as the two Skylanders, Crypt King and Tree Rex. They're known in Genie, but they're still really, really, really cool to have. So, in conclusion from this box, from this box, I'm, I'm going to say that I, I've got more boxes. We will see them open right here on this channel. I'm going to say that all boxes are not created equal. It looks like, in this case, Eruptor wins with two gold hollows, um, with Jetvac in second place with a singular gold hollow, and no gold hollows for Pop Fizz. But that is it. That is the end of my first official booster box opening. Uh, I've opened the entire box, 
Um, and I'm actually really, really, really happy with the results. I, I'm excited. I, I'm really, really happy with what we pulled here. So this is going to be where this video ends. I want to thank you for watching. If you like this sort of content, please be sure to slay that like button. Consider subscribing to the channel. Ring that bell for notifications if you want to see when my videos go live. And check the links in the description below for all the cool things that I do. You'll find my Twitch channel. You'll find my Twitter handle, the community Discord server, and a link to the Skylanders Portalcasters podcast, which if you're a Skylanders fan, you're definitely going to want to check that out. And, uh... Be sure to leave in the comments what your favorite card I pulled in this box was and what you would like to see me, what you hope to see me potentially pull in future openings. Once again, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!